Hello and welcome to Lake News Now on KRMS TV 32. I'm Matt Markovy. Today's top stories. Those wildfires in Canada continue to have an effect on the air quality at Lake of the Ozarks statewide and across a big part of the country. That's according to weatherology's Ray Miller, who says, though, it could be worse. Millions of acres have gone up in flames in Canada since the wildfires were first reported on June 2nd. Air quality reports around the lake blamed on those fires have been categorized as moderately affected. Some rain in the forecast is expected to reduce some of the haze. And a Kaiser couple facing pending felony drug charges lands in the Miller County Jail. 50-year-old Donna Davis is charged with two counts of delivery of a controlled substance, while 49-year-old Bryant Davis is charged with one count of delivery and one count of possession. Both were arrested Monday afternoon. The Sheriff's Department released a statement indicating that they found mushrooms and paraphernalia during a traffic stop. Bryant Davis also allegedly attempted to dispose of 1,000 counterfeit Percocet pills containing fentanyl while at the jail. Both have since posted bond and been released. And a Phillipsburg man finds himself in jail after allegedly attempting to flee the Highway Patrol. That's according to the Highway Patrol report, which indicates that 47-year-old Daniel Ford is being charged with felony resisting, felony possession of methamphetamine, possession of drug paraphernalia, and traffic-related offenses. Ford was taken to the Laclede County Jail and put on a 24-hour hold. And that's your Lake News Now. I'm Matt Markovy.